Korea was in complete ruins after the Korean War, but it showed unprecedented economic growth. How was it possible for Korea to be where it is today in just several decades? What is the secret that made it possible for Korea to undergo such rapid development and changes? Korean economic growth was, uh, I guess it is uh, a, a miracle. Experts state that the secret is in Korea's Balibali culture. Balibali Bali culture and the systems, it's incredible. The world is seeing rapid changes during the post-COVID-19 era. How are you? What kind of a role will Korea's Bali Bali culture play in the future? A Chinese restaurant in Suwon City, Gyeonggi-do Province, promptly begins cooking dishes as soon as the order comes in, and they wrap them up as quickly as they can. They can speed up the preparation as all the steps are systemized. The packaged meal is handed to the delivery courier who's waiting outside. It's placed inside the delivery box and the courier whizzes off to the customer. The courier braves through the cold wind and arrives at his destination. He hurries to deliver food to his client. Jajangmyeon is laid out on the dining table in just 20 minutes after the order is made. Many things have changed after the COVID-19 outbreak. 코로나 이전에는 홀영업도 가능했었는데 코로나 때문에 이제 홀영업이 중단이 됐고요. 대부분의 매장이 배달 전문으로 전환을 했고. The orders are placed through a Gyeonggi-do Province delivery application. 또 소비자 입장에서는 전화를 하지 않아도 되는 편리함이 있고요. 저희들 같은 경우도 전화를 받지 않고 그냥 간단하게 주문 접수 전표만으로도 접수를 할수 있는 상황이기 때문에. According to data released by Statistics Korea. The transactions for last year's online food delivery went up 78.6% compared to the previous year. Gyeonggi-do province quickly developed the delivery application service for its residents. The application made by Gyeonggi-do province lowered the commission fee to 1%, making it less burdensome for small business owners. So this number here, I'm just, uh, you know, lunch and dinner time. The Gyeonggi-do province application has over 120,000 registered users, and the total amount of business was approximately 3.8 million U.S. dollars. I've always said that uh, Korea has the capacity for rapid change. Uh, we, uh, the society, the, the economy adjusts to new realities very, very quickly. Contact-free transactions became very active after the COVID-19 outbreak, and Korea saw an increase in parcel delivery service. Thanks to the quick and efficient delivery system, users can receive the ordered goods wherever they are. That is why consumers didn't go on a panic buying spree in Korea. Certainly there was no panic buying in Korea, and I think that the, the, the stable supply system is probably the reason. Also, different mentality, I think. Instead of getting bewildered and complaining about the unexpected change, Koreans adjusted and quickly found ways to cope with the switch in their lifestyles. People are restricted from outdoor activities due to COVID-19, so even traditional markets have decided to go digital and receive online orders. Ah, 네 고객님들께서 인터넷상으로 주문을 해주시면 저희 어플에 어떤 것들을 주문해 주셨는지 들어오거든요. 그걸 확인하고 있었습니다. People can order through an application instead of going to markets, and the delivery centers at markets deliver the orders within two hours. Online orders gradually increased, and these days, traditional markets receive hundreds of orders per day. Everyone is working hard to come up with a solution, which will help them stay afloat during the pandemic. Jeju Island is located in the southernmost tip of the Korean peninsula. The island is known for three plenties, wind, rock, and the ocean. It is also rich in one particular fruit. Jeju Island's specialty is tangerines. Many farmers operate small tangerine farms on the island. The harvested tangerines are promptly delivered to people through a well-developed distribution system 
no matter how small the orders are. Users can even check the travel path of their orders. There is a fierce competition in speed. The tangerines travel through the night and arrive safely at the customer's door, thanks to the delivery couriers. Alex is from England, and he lived in Korea for a decade, but he's still surprised by Korea's prompt delivery system. I ordered this yesterday from Jeju Island, which obviously is as far as you can get within South Korea. From Jeju. And uh, it came all the way here the next day. That's very fast. Approximately half of the Korean population purchase necessary items via mobile applications, and they can receive their orders promptly in less than 24 hours. There hasn't been a government-enforced lockdown here in South Korea. The citizens have, for the most part, dutifully done their part and stayed at home and not gone out where possible, and that's a great thing. And they've done that because they've been able to access so many goods and services through delivery, through uh, tech bear services, as you say. And I think that's really helped people stay inside, but not only stay inside, but maintain a level of sanity where possible. Korea promptly adapts to new changes, and the swiftness stands out in industries. The Consumer Electronics Show, CES, was held online for four days from January 11th this year. South Korea had the second highest number of companies participating in CES after the United States. This year's key topic for CES was home economy, a combination of the words home and economy. Due to COVID-19, homes have become tech-savvy so that people can work remotely. Numerous Korean companies won accolades with their innovative and smart products. First of all, uh, it caught the trend that was already in Korea. We'd already been working towards uh, uh, home solutions. As you know, our family sizes are getting smaller, so people are ordering uh, smaller portions on a more regular basis. Everything is done, I would say not even internet, everything is now mobile. So the, the Korean society had already moved towards um, uh, managing your life, your business, your banking, whatever, uh, from your mobile phone. So the timing of that was very, very fortunate. Yeah, I think it was very, very successful. And again, Bali Bali, I think Korean companies are able to change very, very quickly. Due to the acceleration of home economy, FMB businesses are seeing rapid growth as they present a wide assortment of easy-to-make meals. This restaurant opened last June after COVID-19 broke out. It sells and delivers seafood meal kits. There is a wide assortment of meal kits to suit the preferences of consumers. Freshly caught seafood from the Southern Sea are conveniently packaged and safely delivered to the restaurant in Seoul. Vegetables are additionally packaged to make meal kits. Convenient meals are very popular during the contact-free era, and the market size is predicted to grow up to approximately 4.4 billion US dollars. 새벽 배송을 통한 이제 안전하고 신속한 식료품 구매를 하게 되는 트렌드가 이 코로나19 이후에 폭발적으로 증가를 했기 때문에 기본적으로 포스트 코로나 이후에도 사실 이러한 새벽 배송 그리고 이런 밀키트 구매는 쉽게 어 이렇게 사그러들 것 같지 않기 때문에 Last December, the OECD predicted Korea's economic growth to be number 1 out of its member nations and second place amongst the top 20 countries. Korea managed the pandemic very well, particularly in the early stages, and we were able to well balance personal protection and health and safety with keeping the economy open. How do foreigners feel about the Bali Bali culture in their daily lives? It's definitely the most convenient place I've ever lived. Yeah. Definitely, by far. I will second Everything that. Everything is yeah. fast. Everything is easy. Everything is convenient. really set up. It's, yeah. conven it's really convenient. I think another important area that I've noticed is safety. You definitely don't want Pali Pali if someone's building a bridge, for example. No. It's not going to be a... Perfect balance between Pali Pali work-life balance in Korea. <laughs> <laughs> but if you had that, if there was a, a perfect way to achieve that, 
Yeah, that would be fantastic. 빨리 빨리 만들다 보면 절차를 무시하고 규칙을 무시해서 뭔가를 빠르게 만드는 데만 초점을 맞추게 되기 때문에 일을 통해서 생겨날 위험을 간과할 우려가 있다는 거죠. Speed doesn't just bring about convenience. There is a train that signifies Korea's speed and efficiency. It's the high-speed train KTX, which allows travelers to conveniently arrive at major cities. People can reach any city in Korea within half a day. Our lives have changed, bringing about a positive impact on regional economic development. The trains are almost never late, thanks to the Bali Bali culture. Then, what is the historical background behind the Bali Bali culture? South Korea experienced anguish during the Japanese colonization period and went through hardships during the Korean War. And thus, it became a nation with absolute poverty, a country that relied on aid from the international society. People barely had enough to eat and had to worry about their future meals. $60 per capita, is, it's a ridiculous numbers. Uh, I was born at that time and re I was really poor, nothing to eat. Any. So we, we have to work hard and to survive and uh, uh, that changed a lot of people's mentalities. So we throw away the, uh, the slow behavior. And if we slow, you're dead, so obviously. In 1962, the Korean government began a five-year economic development plan to achieve economic growth. Manufacturing and construction industries grew every year. Soon, Korea achieved the miracle of Hangang River. In 1956, exports only totaled to 25 million US dollars, but by 1995, the Korean economy succeeded in achieving 100 billion US dollars. This is an unprecedented achievement in the world. Samsung Electronics became the world's first company to develop the 64 MD RAM in 1992. Korea uh, made a decision, actually, at that time, Samsung, Hyundai, and LG Group uh, chairmen tried to uh, invest to uh, the semiconductor industry. At that time, we were so much behind, about like six years behind. So at that, starting from that point, we were working very hard. Um, spali spali mode is right there, exactly. So we worked like a, I worked 365 days, seven days a week, not necessarily 24 hours a day, but at least I worked uh, from like a 14 hours a day. So we did it uh, eight years uh, later. Can you believe that? In this global market and it become number one. The Nomion administration perceived the IT industries as future growth engines and focused on actively fostering Korea's IT industries. Now focusing on really fundamental mathematical things, let's make it quick applications. Make us things happening out there. So bring them in here. Let's put into the telecom, smartphones or whatever. You know, we, can, we just make a quicker commercialization. That really worked. That's the basis of uh, Korean strategy at that time. Things are working very quickly, you know. Korea is famous for its fast cycle of product development, commercialization, as well as product supplementation. Korea is the world's largest digital economy. Korean people are the first to use 인터넷을 비롯한 IT 인프라가 굉장히 잘 갖춰진 국가입니다. The boundaries between outlets have collapsed in the fourth industrial revolution, and technological convergence has become crucial. What are some forties of Korea in the fourth industrial revolution? 4차 산업혁명의 특징을 전문가들이 설명하는 대표적인 용어가 바로 속도 곱하기 다양성입니다. 굉장히 빠른 속도로 다양한 분야에서 혁신이 벌어진다는 뜻인데. 이 빨리빨리 문화는 속도 측면에서 한국의 4차 산업혁명 진전에 굉장히 큰 도움이 될수 있는 그 전통적인 문화죠, 우리의. 데이터든 빠르게 축적하고 빠르게 공유해야 됩니다. 빨리 움직여야 돼요. 네트워크는 그것의 기반이 됩니다. 그리고 인공지능은 이렇게 축적된 데이터를 신속하게 분석하고 예측을 해줘야 됩니다. 결국 속도가 생명인 거죠. You know that we have a bibimbap, jambong, so put them all together. We don't do it like uh, 
you have appetites and main dishes and and then a, a dessert or whatever. We are not doing that. We're full of all together having at the same time, right? So it's, it's slightly different mentality. It's a fusion kind of thing is very natural to us. Korea's bali bali culture can also be seen in sports. Korean athletes undergo systemized training and achieve great results in and outside of Korea. Korean citizens work together to show passion and root for the national teams when international matches are held. We can also see this phenomenon in education. There is controversy about Korea's cramming education, but the effective education system is highly assessed worldwide. South Korea is replacing all of its textbooks with... Former U.S. President Barack Obama highly praised Korea's education system. After the COVID-19 outbreak, Korea became one of the fastest countries in the world to make a successful transition to remote learning. iPads come through tablets, it comes through smartphone devices, it comes through televisions. Uh, national broadcasters will give them these things. So I, I think it's really important. 전 세계에서 1위 그리고 가정마다 퍼스널 컴퓨터가 보급되어 있는데 보급률이 71%가 넘습니다. 집집마다 개인마다 디지털 기기가 보급되어 있고 이 기기가 빠르게 움직일 수 있는 네트워크가 지금 함께 있답니다. 이러다 보니까 온라인 교육이 원활하게 진행됐던 게 사실이고 또 하나 한국이 디지털 컨텐츠를 만드는 기술이 굉장히 빨라지고 있거든요. 좋아지고 있습니다. 그래서 이 디지털 컨텐츠를 만드는 기술과 디지털 기기 그리고 뛰어난 네트워크 이것이 작동하면서 한국의 온라인 교육이 세계적인 모범이 됐다고 생각을 합니다. Alex is a journalist and he has been remotely working from home once the pandemic broke out. He didn't feel an ounce of inconvenience from working from home thanks to the high-speed internet connection. People can easily receive text messages and acquire information about COVID-19, as well as the daily confirmed cases. Experts have been giving daily COVID-19 briefings. Thanks to the active communication with the public, the Korean government managed to cope with COVID-19 crisis without practicing any lockdown. Last year, Alex received the COVID-19 diagnostic test after receiving a text message which stated that there were several confirmed cases in his neighborhood. The entire process, from receiving the test to getting the results, was done promptly. Foreign media gave high evaluations about K-quarantine. This place is leading K-quarantine during the COVID-19 era. One hospital building is used to treat COVID-19 patients. A walkthrough testing center has been set up on the first floor so that anyone can receive the COVID-19 test. Korea developed the effective walkthrough testing centers as well as drive-through test sites. 네, 저희가 선별 진료소에서 이제 뭐 코로나가 의심되거나 발열 환자를 먼저 이제 예진처럼 하는 일을 하는데요. 코로나 검사를 할때 보호복을 입지 않고도 이렇게 격벽이랑 장갑이 설치된 벽을 통해서 검체를 채취하면은 실제로 바이러스를 차단할 수 있어서 의료진들이 좀 바이러스로부터 안전한 환경에서 일하도록 고안된 장치입니다. It differs every day, but on average about 50 people, and at times almost 100 people, come to be tested per day. Korea's quarantine and complete recovery rate have become a model example and are being benchmarked by other countries. The quick and accurate diagnostic kits also played an important role. With this innovative approach, each sample collection takes less than five minutes, and it enabled rapid and massive testing and eventually tracing triage treatment, so-called 4T strategies. The COVID-19 isolation wards are located on the upper floor of the building. This place treats severe patients and the medical staff monitors patients 24 hours a day. There are unfortunate cases where healthcare officials became infected with COVID-19 while treating patients. Kim Dahi, an active nurse, was diagnosed with the coronavirus. After receiving treatment, she returned to the negative pressure isolation ward to take care of patients. 어차피 누군가는 꼭 해야 되는 일이고 그게 그냥 저라는 생각으로 계속 일했었던 것 같아요. 
The unconditional dedication of Kim Dae-hee was publicized, and the thanks to challenge began spreading. The hospital established a dual-track healthcare system strategy after the COVID-19 outbreak. The medical system for contagions was completely separated from the treatment system for non-COVID-19 patients. Not many hospitals allow emergency surgeries for COVID-19 patients due to concerns on additional infections. Emergency surgeries for COVID-19 patients are now successfully done thanks to negative pressure isolation operation theaters. 음압으로 교체했을 경우에는 여기가 마이너스 표시가 됩니다. 그럼 바람이 밖으로 나가는 게 아니라 안으로 다 빨려 들어가는 It prevents the spread of viruses which are released when patients breathe out. The world has become smaller with globalization and the globe village is suffering from the rapid transmission of infectious disease. It is now time for a paradigm shift. We are passing through the time when solidarity and the cooperation are demanded for existence. Government officials who operate the COVID-19 response system are also applauded. Prior to the COVID-19 outbreak, Korea's Ministry of the Interior and Safety has publicized and provided data owned by government offices to citizens. Such open data helped minimize the shock over COVID-19. Korea was in the top spots in the OECD Open Data Index. Korea also came in second place in the United Nations E-Government Development Index in 2020. Korea's governmental system became digitalized, and people can easily pay taxes in a contact-free manner. The utilization rate for the service reached 88%, with a satisfaction rate of 98%. Bali Bali culture and the systems, it's incredible because we receive text messages and alerts on our phones at all time. It's not a case of me requesting it. It's a case of this information can help you save lives. The government gives you that. We've never been in lockdown here in South Korea. This is a great example of that it's not discriminating against people with access to internet or phones or sound or visuals. South Korea has done very well to realize that this information is a tool. It's a weapon to fight against this pandemic. The digital influence is growing during the COVID-19 era. What is the criteria needed to achieve a more mature Bali Bali culture? So until today, the industrialization really pushed the people and make them sacrifice a lot, but now the personal happiness is more probably important. So somehow uh, we already realized that Bali Bali is not the only one that we have to uh, figure out and uh, rely on, but we have to have a really well-balanced or people should realize that it's right. To sublimate the Bali Bali culture into an advanced culture, we must strive for convenience and speed, but we must also protect the civil rights of workers and vulnerable groups. Maintaining the right balance between safety and qualitative improvement is crucial. I, I, hope, I hope that we can preserve the Bali Bali because that's our competitive advantage. At the same time, developing the planning capability and so we have a little bit more uh, direction and, and clarity of where we're going. The Bali Bali culture is part of both the success and to a certain degree, part of the problems. What it does going forward, it requires educated, conscious, aware, democratic citizens, and it requires an environment for them to be able to communicate and talk about these ideas. I believe they will do it. The Bali Bali culture has a tremendous impact on the Korean society. It has become a part of the Korean industries, systems, and culture. Koreans have had a desperate urge to succeed, and they do their best to move forward as they naturally accept change. K-innovation was possible because of Korean citizens. South Korea grew exponentially because of its citizens, who will continue to strive forward in the rapidly changing and uncertain future.